Hello everybody. It's April 14, 2008. This is the stock car session on Real Fast TV. Well, had quite a weekend at the Sprint Cup this weekend. Uh, I got to see a little bit of the race as we were doing the race up at Bakersfield Speedway. We had a TV, TV sitting there and uh, it was pretty cool. There, there was a lot of action and uh, I, I definitely thought someone else was going to win the race. I was really pulling for Kevin Harvick, and uh, I saw he ended up 19th. They had, he had some sort of problem, but uh, Jimmy Johnson won the race. Clint Boyer got second. Hamlin got third. Carl Edwards got fourth, and Mark Martin got fifth. And uh, Points are going like this. After eight races, it's Jeff Burton, Kyle Busch, Dale Earnhardt Jr., Jimmy Johnson, Kevin Harvick, D Denny Hamlin, Tony Stewart, Clint Boyer, Carl Edwards, and the tenth person is uh, Greg Biffle. So uh, eight races, we're we're going strong right now. Uh, look forward to, to uh, seeing who wins wins the whole deal. I. I, I'm really pulling for Kevin Harvick right now. He's my pick, so uh, let's see what that number 29 car can do. Mears got 11th in the Sprint Cup race, and Harvick got 19th, our two Bakersfield boys. And uh, at the, the Ventura, <coughs> Ventura Racing Association results from Hanford go like this. Peter Murphy won from Fresno. Greg Taylor won from, got second from Ventura. Jonathan Henry from Stockton got third. Fourth was Justine Hamblin from Hanford. And fifth was Kevin Kreese from Reseda. And the banded VRA top ten in points are Peter Murphy, Greg Taylor, Jonathan Henry, Justine Hamblin, Rick Hendricks, Clark Templin, Brandon Thompson, Kevin Barnes, Kevin Kearse, and uh, Jonathan Logan. So uh, those guys are running hard. They just been at uh, Bakersfield Speedway the week before, and they got a got an intense schedule. So uh, we look forward to seeing them back at Bakersfield two more times this year, and uh, we'll be watching Hurricane Heidi running her new car then so uh, stay tuned for that well we were at Bakersfield Speedway this last weekend there were five divisions running uh, the junior dwarfs the dwarf cars the east west super stocks the hobby stocks and the IMCA's and uh, there was some great racing out there and it was pretty clean there weren't a lot of bad wrecks and uh, things went somewhat smoothly East West Super Stocks, the winner was Lonnie Welch. Second was Eric Sennenthal. Third was Tim Randolph. Fourth was Robbie Sawyer. Fifth was Wayne Dotson. Sixth was Jeremiah Van Scoy. Seventh was Nick Sylvester. Eighth was Daryl Hood. Ninth was Toby Randolph. And tenth was Clint Duncan. So, uh,. That was a great race, and uh, those guys put on an awesome show. They're, they were running clean, and uh, it, it not a lot of major things happened. So check that out on our on our site. The race is on the players. Player uh, the IMCA modifieds went like this: Brad Pounds first, second Randy Schweitzer, third Jay Marks, fourth Gary Dutton and fifth Brady Bell so uh, and that was a great race too pounds had to come from all the way from the back to win that one and uh, he was he was running hot and I just have to say he's got something you know that guy can drive a car and uh, we look forward to seeing him this coming week at the Western All-Stars and I got a little footage of him driving uh, Dick Shepard's car for later so uh, we'll get to that a little later the hobby stocks went like this. Bruce Johnson won his second race of the year. Jason Bannister was second. Third was Devin Jones. Fourth was Brian Terry. And fifth was Tom Manzella. 
and uh, they put on a great show too. There was just some excellent racing out there. Mini Dwarfs went like this. The 9 to 13 main was Brody Schweitzer, Jacob Poole, and Trenton Miller. In the 5 to 8, Tyler Bannister, Tony Lamas, Marissa Dodson, Brooklyn Bell, and Ashlyn Puckett. And you can see a lot of girls are coming in there to race. So, uh, hey, let's see if uh, we'll see, see who's calling here. Hang on. Hello? Listen carefully. Well, they're trying to sell me something again. You never know, though. Could have been, uh, could have been someone else. So uh, that's good. We're also, we're also looking at uh, had the hobby stock, and then we had the dwarf cars. The A main was uh, won by Brian Saxon. Mike Van Acker was second. Roy Estrada was third. Fourth was Craig Clements, and fifth was Jim Lyon, and uh, they put on a good show too. And that both the junior minis, the dwarfs, and the uh, dwarf cars will. I'm going to stream them after this, and they'll be on the left side of the of the site. You'll see them on the left side there. I'll have them put on there. So uh, we're looking forward to some great racing this weekend. It's Western All-Stars this weekend and those are the big boys. They're coming back to Bakersfield and uh, Brad Pounds and Dick Shepard have made a uh, partnership. Brad's going to be driving for Dick and he'll be driving uh, Dick Shepard's 22 car. So uh, it's a uh, it's it's something that it's kind of interesting how these relationships are because Scott Pounds and Dick Shepard were the two biggest rivals ever here at, at Bakersfield Speedway and uh, to have them come together now and and have Brad drive the car shows how racing changes and how the people at the track are friends and even though they race against each other and stuff that there are a lot of friendships made out there and. Uh, I was really surprised to hear about it, to tell you the truth. So, uh, got a little footage right now of uh, Brad going around the track. They gave him a little little time, so let's uh, let's see the footage. for Dick Shepard. Oh, he drives for him. Okay. Yeah, that's his... Uh, this Saturday night we'll be out there live at 8.30 and uh, we'll be some awesome action so uh, stay tuned uh, this is Jeff Tilsher for RealFast.TV your racing channel